for tuning back into the channel. We're going to get right into this three-day mountain adventure, but I just need to send a shout out one more time to Lee Power for sponsoring my video once again. Lee Power sent me this portable power station which comes in super handy for my long road trips. I use it to charge my phone, my camera batteries, a power bank, anything I need. Besides road trips, you can keep it at home for a power outage. It's too big for backpacking, but it's great for car camping. You can charge this power station in four ways, either from a traditional wall outlet, the cigarette lighter in the car, a generator, or even with solar panels. You can use it to charge or run cell phones, laptops, drones, coffee makers, CPAP machines, TVs, toasters, refrigerators, lights, fans, and more. For output, this power station features a Type-C plug, three USB ports including one quick charge, as well as three standard 110 volt power outlets. Please check the link in my description for more info. Now let's get right into this three day camping adventure in the mountains of Kentucky with myself, my nephew Christian, and his dad Ben. I hope you enjoy it. Nice. Yeah. All right. Ben's taking a five. We're all taking a five. Christian's in his dope little chill spot. <laughs> This is an absolutely nice payout just sitting up here on this. I know. Sandstone, is that what this is? I think so. Do you guys feel like adventurers? Yes. Yes. Daniel Boone. He probably, yeah, and we're in Daniel Boone Forest. He probably uh, sat up here or something. He probably did. <laughs> oh, right? Yeah. Ah, it looks like it's right in your eye. It's just, no, I... a good spot though. Oh okay, it just drops down there. Yeah. Here it is. No, it's no there's a little ledge right there. Oh. Honestly I hit that tree before I even fall down off. a little. This is because of two plate plates going like wow one rising over the other or oh that's someone oh 
Oh yeah, people camp here. Honestly, I can see why they do. Now, is the little cavern thing, is that all the way down the bottom? Yeah. How do we even get down here? There's a trail. Oh. It's, kind of, it's crazy how we're so high up and there's just a little trail that goes down here. Is that that, oh, a couple of things. Is that that cave you saw? I think so. It, yeah, it is. I'm pretty sure. Oh, even better. Oh my goodness. All right, everybody. Well, welcome back to the channel. Hopefully by now you've seen a lot of footage of us uh, doing a hike in. Um, I'll check the stats and uh, verify exactly what we did here, but I think we did between three to four miles and about eight to 900 feet of elevation over that. Easy. Um, and we, <laughs> we barely made it in here. We are at the very, very, very tail end of dusk. So we're gonna cut the camera, get set up and get everything situated. And that's when we'll check back with you in a bit here. Hey. All right, so we're gonna do a quick little tour around the camp here. So here's my setup. Got a little bit of a gear bomb going on. The fly, there's it's not supposed to be rain tonight, so gotta get my uh, sleeping bag out and in there, get that fluffed up. But Ben and Christian just got done setting up this bad boy. Holy moly. <laughs> Christian, can you go stand next to there so they can see, like a frame of reference? So this is quite the palace, these two. <laughs> Father and son got going on there. This thing is pretty awesome. What does that say? Lux? Yeah. Lux Outdoors? It's like seven foot five. It's seven foot five tall? All right. It's got a hole for a stove jack, so it still needs the actual stove jack. Oh, you, it, it came with it? Okay. So that is pretty awesome. And there's a little fire pit. We've got a nice big pile of kindling. We've got some stage two, and then we're going to process up this log here. So we'll get back with you guys in a bit. I know, well mine did when I went out to see uh, Grandma's hiking group. Uh, I got a new blade, but the blade was like 40 bucks or something just oh, for the blade. How much was the saw? Uh, 60 or 70 bucks. Okay. That should be enough to get us going here. Got a little bit, dude. 
Hurry up. I'm going to be late for the bus. <laughs> What's that? Bat Dad. Oh. <laughs> Have you heard of him? Yeah, I know Bat Dad. It's white and it's very black. You can go with anything else you're wearing with the hat. You need birch bark too, that's the thing, if you don't have birch bark. It's, it's hard to get it to go. Do we have any water? Um, your dad has a little bit, or unless it's gone. And a water. Oh. We can go get some. It's still early, it's just dark. We can go get some from that stream. Uh, I hiked open this. Okay. I'm glad I didn't. Have you ever seen that In what? Big Bang Theory. Um, I've seen some episodes. Pretty funny. Like Dude, we're rocking and rolling. Wow, already. Bada bing, Only bada boom. Like five minutes or less. Flat area. That's nice. Pretty good, huh? Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, you get more of those. Got cheaper than Mountain House and smaller and easier to make. Yeah. Wouldn't know which I've ever learned. Alright everybody, we got our, our fire going here. Um, starting to die down a little bit. We'll put that out in a little bit here, but we'll We'll sit around it for a little bit. We had a, a heck of a hike earlier today, and we're gonna um, have a little toast to uh, busting our humps to get up here. Yes, sir. Cheers, Ben. That works. Cheers, Christian. <laughs> oh, you got smoke in his eyes. Ha ha. Cheers. <laughs> oh, man. Whoa, better than I remember. <sighs> Uh, Good, yeah. yingling. Mm -hmm. mm, L8. <laughs> <laughs> you love your L8 though, right? Yeah, I mean, Chris, it's, it's like the only thing that comes down here. That's here. It's yeah. so good. Christian's uh, 13, so, <laughs> so he has L8, which is like uh, Kentucky ginger ale. If anything happens, you know, we'll, we'll show it to you guys, but otherwise we'll just check back with you in the morning and uh, we're going to do some exploring around, go see some sites and some overlooks and some uh rock structures and some this and some that and uh if uh if we don't have anything else for you we'll uh we'll see you back in the morning cheers cheers christian cheers man cheers audience okay and we're officially done Good morning, everybody. Um, this is going to be our uh, uh, nice full day here on the top of Indian Staircase. 
So we're gonna camp here again tonight, but during the day, we're gonna walk around and see all the sites since we got in here pretty late last night. And um, uh, so we're gonna do some sightseeing and we got a rough plan for what we're gonna do. We'll take you along for that. But first things first, we're gonna go back um, down into council chambers and get some water so we can make these uh, mountain house breakfasts that we need to make. Oh, there's a bunch of people down here. Yeah, I think they work here. Oh, really? Yeah, we saw some people that work here, I think. Whoa. Oh, you got a little um, thing for your head. I was here last year. Or, God, yeah, I was right here last year. I couldn't put you last year. So we just saw the water runs through a little stream over going this way, and this might be easier to get the water out of. All right, boy, I'm going to live from Birmingham. It's almost Ireland. It's not like they sound good. Everything with you is how long is something going to take? I'm not patient. It's the no, process. you're not. And patience is a virtue and you need to learn it. Now, can you fill this up again, please? Three. <laughs> yeah, you're making it take longer. <laughs> <laughs> that be fun. I'm gonna need the backwash for the camping is fun with Sam. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I complain a lot more when you're not there. <laughs> Everything's an annual window with this kid. And we just gotta get it to get it stirred. All right, so we, I was boiling this water here, um, trying to get the uh, mountain houses good to go. And Ben and Christian went around and got a big, nice big pile of kindling for the fire later. Yeah. So we should be set on the kindling. We'll have to get some, uh, some regular wood. Right, Christian? Sure. Are you having like the time of your life? Cold. You like how he commandeered your gloves there? Yeah, he totally commandeered my gloves. Like totally just <laughs> gonna slip those I thought you'd be used to temperatures like this in Mother Russia. <laughs> no, <I feel> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's very comrade-y. It's warm though. Well, it's warm. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't think about gloves. That doesn't look too bad. <laughs> We also have like ramen noodles and stuff. Mm-hmm. Do we? Yeah. I didn't see anything. We have like one or two cups, maybe. Mm. You got the cups. Mm-hmm. Makes it easier. I like the cheese flavor the ones. Oh, yeah. That's where it's at. Okay, guys. Well, that was uh, breakfast. We had the mountain houses. Um, how'd you guys think your mountain houses no, were? Nasty. No. A little, a little gross. 
A little gross. Tastes yeah. good. It's just, you know, crunchy biscuits. Crunchy biscuits and crunchy potatoes and, yeah. <laughs> crunchy eggs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Christian said his mountain house was, uh, was not Loki bussin', right? <laughs> so we're going to um, do a loop here. We got some sights that we want to see. So we got like the whole day. We're staying here again tonight. So we got a whole day just to hike today. So we're going to go around and uh, we're going to go check out uh, Indian Staircase, which is the main feature here, which is a pretty long, pretty tall rock scramble. So we're going to go eyeball it and see if we feel like doing it. But we see other people doing it, teenagers, and we saw pregnant what? women. Yeah, we saw a pregnant woman <laughs> last night that had done it and was in a big group. Toddlers. Like, <laughs> yeah, it liter literally toddlers were doing it. So we don't have too much of an excuse, but we're going to eyeball it. And if we feel like it, we'll do it. And if we don't, we'll walk the long way all the way back around again. So all the packs, so make we don't have packs this time. Yeah, so, be... yeah. So we'll check back with you guys in a bit. Hi, every goofy face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is this Loki bussing yet? <laughs> yeah, this view is bussing. <laughs> this view slaps. <laughs> Look, those people are just, there's plenty of space on there. We're fine. It's so beautiful. You see what they're doing? What? You can't see it because you're not zoomed in. See, he's walking it though. Are you not supposed to? Zoom my, my no, it's fine. Much. You're zooming more, can you? I, I can, but it's going to be blurry. So let me get the other camera out. Hundred millimeters. Yeah, it goes all the way up to two hundred. <laughs> Are they actually? Oh, that guy's dancing around like a crazy guy. <laughs> Looks all like Roanoke Ridge, doesn't it? Um, is that Red Dead Redemption? Yeah. It's the place where Van Horn's at. Wait, which way is this? It's still this way. Oh, is there a split? Yeah. There's a campsite with a bunch of people. There's a campsite with a bunch of people. <laughs> it's crazy. I can't really see the screen because I got it on that stick, but drop selfie stick. <laughs> yep. It's beautiful out here though. Can't say that enough. You can kind of see where the river is going. Can you? You can see like how the trees kind of bend. Like you can see that the valley it comes in where the river goes. You can see that. Like every river comes from a, a little tiny hole somewhere. Is that where rivers come from? Mm hmm. Never get old no matter what. No, no, it won't. Ah. Pretty cool. Yeah. That's pretty wild. There's more that either moss or oh my god. Here's what we're coming for. I see why now. I wonder if this is lichen. And I'm liking your mom. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now I see why it's an arch. Yeah. Can we go down there? Yeah. You can probably camp under here. I mean, I'm sure people have. People have definitely been down here. Look at sheep. Did you hear that? 
What's that? I threw a stick down and I just heard it like. Oh, really? Wow. Dad, come here. You're heavy as a stick. Did you guys hear what he said this thing was called? No. Adina's head or something? Oh, yeah. Something so, head. And not crazy. not frog's head, because that's over by where we're at. Really? It's called something. I can't roll it against that. It doesn't look the same kind of rock, even. It's not. It's pretty crazy. They might have put something here. Mm, yeah. God, who the hell would have done that? It's the heavy rock. I don't know. Perfect place for it, though. It sits perfectly. Some kind of ancient native writing. I mean, it looks like there was a fire pit here at one point. Yeah. Oh. Oh, jeez. That spot always felt funny for like ten years. It's gorgeous, right? No, that's not it. It's cool though. Yeah, that's it. I'm turning around. It's not as bad as it looks. Here we go. Okay, this is Indian Staircase. This is the very, very uh, start of going up into a uh, crevasse, I guess you'd call it up there. And then we start the actual staircase on the other side of that. So here we go.
to do this. It's actually easier than the hiking, I think. I feel like. Because then there's that part right there, like, practically scale. It's not as crazy as you think it's going to be. I'm not sure. What'd you say you see there? It's like a trail that goes up there. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're definitely not going to climb up those rocks Aww. like that. We're, yeah, we're not doing that. We'll do the trail. It's not, like, there's a trail that you can just walk straight up. I know. Yeah, I mean, probably. It, it's to be perfectly honest. It's I've only done it once. Oh God! I mean, if you count all that, we're probably past halfway. <laughs> if you count the hike. want to do that again. How do you feel about this? I don't know. How did you do this last time? Man, I only did it once. Well, you just go right here. Yeah, that's uh. Does it look too crazy? Looks easy. I don't know.
get you up here if we didn't think you could do it. Trust us, Preston. You're not slipping at all? If I fall, no big deal. Preston, right, trust you know. us. I mean, it's not great, but... And then once I'm here, it's like, that's not hard. That's not hard. Alright. That, that Woohoo! Okay. Now, what about your dad? That's too far. <laughs> well, we're stopping from that, right? Yeah. Oh my God! Look at that man. It doesn't do any justice on the cliff. No. It really doesn't. Man, look at that view, though, Ben. And look what you did, man. Uh, it's impressive. You did all of this. Had it, didn't you? Yeah. Physical ability. Yeah, but you got up it, dude. You did it. We did it. I'm pretty fit. Well, I mean, look what you just did. You might as well have climbed up the side of a mountain. I mean, we literally did. Yeah, we, we did. We climbed up the side of a mountain. Use my hands. Wouldn't mind going down this way, though. It's pretty easy. Just tumble. See, yeah, just fall. <laughs> All right, we did it. These people putting campfires right like that and just camping here. I mean, that's just crazy. And that's frog's head. Looks just like a frog. And people will repel from that. Yeah, they they mountain climb all the way down to the to the bottom. Man, I hope we got enough footage because we had a hell of a day. We really had a hell of a day. I mean, we went all the way and rode that freaking thing. We went all the way over. We saw that arch thingy, and then we we did the, the uh, cave council chambers, and then we came all the way and climbed that. Wild. Side of the I need to I need to start putting my tracker on as far as I'm walking. I know. I keep track of what I can I know how far it's going. Shotgun wedding, brown ale, aged on vanilla beans. Cheers. <laughs> Sorry, Christian. Right. Christian had uh uh Six ale eights, but he drank them all already. So. <laughs> gotta learn to pace yourself, buddy. Yeah, you gotta pace yourself. We are ready to get our fire started, and we're ready to have a leisurely afternoon. 
after say hi Christian hi <laughs> we're ready to uh, get it going and Ben found some firewood over here earlier when he was scavenging for kindling so we're gonna pick up all this stuff over here But sometimes just showing is the right thing, and sometimes I do it wrong, too. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Ooh. You see a bend like that? Right, that should be enough to get us started. I bet that guy was really embarrassed. I wanted to say something to him. I was like, look, dude, I'm about to try to do it. And if I can do it, you know. You wanted to say something encouraging. Yeah, but I was like, I, I did know. say something encouraging. I wanted to, to too, but I was like, he would I just be like, got a big enough support group. Yeah, <laughs> like a giant one. <laughs> yeah, and the lady that was up there uh, was saying that she also wanted to like help him. Yeah, well, it was pretty bad with a lady fifteen years older than me just skips right up there like that. Yeah, she's like sixty or something. <laughs> like I don't know if she's fifty maybe or something. I thought it was like maybe mid fifties. Yeah. So is that birch bark there? Yeah. Where do you find a birch tree? I wonder. Yeah, I got a couple in my yard. Oh, really? there's a birch yep. farmer. Huh? There's a birch farmer. Yeah. That's paper. It's like wax paper. You can eat that. You shouldn't, but you can. Yeah. You can eat wax paper. You can eat you, the, Technically, yeah. I mean, technically, you can eat anything. You don't die. Yeah. Some dude. You can eat poison food. if you want. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can eat anything. Just, you know, just but can you do it more than once right this, this one dude ate an airplane over the past like over a span of 40 years yeah that's ridiculous what yeah he just like kept he there was this broken down airplane he just kept like eating yeah you got people like that and then some people are worried about the aluminum in their in their deodorant right he <laughs> so, yeah. ate a whole airplane <laughs> yeah sure, you're fine their human body's really resilient This is red. Yep. Oh, it feels good.
Can I just squirt that into my mouth? <laughs> Do you need some water? Yeah. Go get your cup. Oh, this doesn't come in so. Noise. <laughs> That's pretty good, huh? Oh yeah. But a lot of times what I do is I just take footage like that. And I put that one song over it. Yeah. Down, 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 down. Um, we are day three, day three, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Three days in the mountains. I mean, you got here Friday evening. Yeah. Yeah. Two and a half. Minutes. So we're leaving. Um, we're going to get camp torn down. We'll see the sights one more time on the way out. And, um, uh, we'll get back with you when we got camp torn down here. All right. Well, that's about, uh, wraps up the packing up. And uh, all we got left to do is hike out, see the sights one more time, and um, uh, drive home. And yeah, we're gonna go get some Waffle House, I think maybe, possibly. We'll see what we can uh, scrounge up. So come on with us, we're heading out of here. Go. All right, we're going this way. Yeah, run this way. Yeah. <laughs> Yep, yeah, just gotta take it in one more time.
Yeah. All right, everybody, we made it back to the car. We're on the way back to Ohio. Thanks so much for everybody. Uh, thanks so much to everybody for tuning in. This has been quite the adventure. Um, and we'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Peace.